<laughs> I got two questions for you. Two questions, sir. Huh? Her? Who? Her. Haley. Haley? Who's Haley? How about you, madam? What's your name? Well, you're being recorded. Yeah. Um, Kim. Kim, I'm Kale. That's my son, Kari. My Hi, wife and my other son, Caius. Hi. Kim, do you know for sure if you'll be in heaven? Yes. All right. And the second question is why should God let you into heaven? Because I accepted Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. That's it. That's it. What, so who is Jesus? My Lord and Savior. I mean, is he is he God? He is, he is Jesus who came as a human. But yeah, he's God. Okay. All right. Yeah. It, it, it tells us. He said he's the Word, and the Word was, was in the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God, yep. right? Yep. Yeah, so that's how we, and, it, and in Isaiah 9, it tells us that he shall be called the Mighty God, the Mighty Father, actually. Right. So we should call him that, right? Amen. We worship him as God. Right. Let's call him God. Yep. Hey, amen. Well, good. Hey, thank you for talking You're to us, Amy. Welcome. That's a blessing. I appreciate it. Of course. God yeah. bless you guys. Yeah, you too. Share that oh, with somebody. Get, I'm about ready to get Phil 413. Philippians 4.13, what is that one? I um, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Amen. That's it. Amen. God bless. All right. Two, two questions, guys. Two questions, real quick. Two questions, guys. Two quick questions. No? Huh? Oh. How about you guys? Two quick questions. <laughs> Good job, Kari. Keep getting them. Worth money if you get the right answer. Two questions. Huh? Don't be shy. <laughs> oh. All right, he's got two questions for you. Don't be shy. <laughs> How about you, madam? No? How about you, sir? Two quick questions. What's your name? Alan. Alan, this is my son, Kari. Say hi. Hey, Kari. <laughs> All right, I'm Kale. This is my wife and my son. Do you know for sure if you'll be in heaven when you die, Alan? Yes. You do? All right, and the second question is why should God let you into heaven? Because I've done everything I can. You've done everything you can? Well, you know Ephesians 2, 8 and 9 says, For by grace are you saved through faith, and that not of yourselves. It's a gift of God, not of works, lest any man should boast. So what did God do for you, Alan? Everything. Well, 2,000 years ago, in John 3, 16, it says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Have you heard that before? Well, your belief on Jesus Christ is what saves you. Right? Not, not what you've done. So you've been trusting yourself. So I want to share that gospel with you about believing Jesus and not yourself. Can you believe on what Jesus done for you? Yes. What did he do? He's done a lot. <laughs> he died on the cross and rose from the grave. Yeah. That's what you got to believe. Because when, uh, when Paul and Silas were asked by the Philippian jailer, he said, what must I do to be saved? He said, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved in thy house. So believe on him, okay? Thank you. You got a Bible at home? Yeah. Read it, man. Take time to read it. Two questions, guys. What's, no? Okay.